What is up everybody? Welcome back to a brand new video on the goddamn internet. I'll have two number nines. Dude, I heard that you're like really gay. Like you call other people gay and you make fun of them for being gay and you talk about gender politics so much that I think you just really like dick. I just want to give a shout out to Zenison. You are the best. So I uh, wake up this morning, uh, got some breakfast, and turn on my phone. I look at YouTube, and uh, you know what's waiting for me? Of course, it's a national gem, the EB family. Now you are uh, maybe wondering who these people are, and. Uh, they're, they're great people, don't worry. White tea, every day, clean, day and night, sleep, kidnap your girl, make a move. Hello everyone, and uh, welcome back to a brand new video. Oh, Jesus. I can't do it. I can't. I don't sound like Leafy. I, I don't sound like him. I want to preface that yes, guys, you made a video on it, but uh, he sounds like a walrus. Anyway, the EB family is just a, a treasure, a beautiful treasure. Remember the Lunchables debacle? Well, uh, not really that big. Yeah, that, that's that. Wait, uh, at the time of filming, we understood him to be 19. To clarify, he is 17 years old. Dear Kedek, she's only 15. GG, I guess. So there's been this drama. A guy named Killick made a video on the EB family. Said some edgy shit and uh, he used cool, I guess. But he did say some fuck shit. A uh, fellow edgelord. And the EB family responded to him for some dumb reason. And it was a uh, very good, best response video ever. They accused him of being a pedophile and failing to do research. Uh, they also said that they were going to terminate his channel. I mean, he did say it was to make them mad, so you kind of succeeded there. They big mad, but uh, as Toxic Distress says, let's dive into this landfill. Oh, pa -pa 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 play that shit. Before we begin this video, if you are under the age of 18, this video may not be suitable for you to watch. Thank you for scaring away all the kids, the, the small children from the video. This is a good start. Now the nine-year-olds can't bully me anymore. So please um, ask a guardian or a parent to watch it with you. Oh my God, they, they done goofed, they fucked it up. You literally said, this isn't suitable for kids. And then you said, nah, fuck it. As long as they give me that YouTube money. These videos are never easy for us to make. Yeah, guys, I uh, didn't want to make this video. I really didn't. You know, YouTube money? Didn't want to make this video. This video is 26 minutes. Oh my god. But as long as it reaches 10 minutes, right? Be good. However, we feel that with great power comes great responsibility. Oh my god! Spider Man quote! Guys, I just want to see the new movie. Uh, Good movie, go watch. I can already tell this video is going to make me die inside. I honestly don't care anymore, but uh, 10 million subscribers? Next dad feed girls? Completely inappropriate. And when I watched the video, I was absolutely in shock uh, over, over what this YouTuber was saying about our daughter. And so we wanted to present the material to you. Yeah guys, that's right, the disgusting Absolutely disgusting material. You know, you, the six-year-old watching the video, that's right. Forget about the parent. Uh, they don't matter. What matters is that YouTube money. Pretty gay if you ask me. Remember, six-year-olds, if you see a video talking about pedophilia, uh, make sure to click on it straight away because that watch time. From our understanding, this person is 19 years old. Yeah, that's right. From our understanding, that couldn't just be a number that we pulled out of our ass. Now, we did some heavy hitting research. What? The articles and the other mentions of him saying that he's 17? Nah, fuck that. Dude, I, I love bullying kids. Literally, I woke up and he said, I haven't slept all night. I want you to watch this and my whole body started to tremble. Wow, uh, I feel really sorry for you. Uh, I feel really sorry. Hope you get better from the uh, hard-hitting content that you said was only to make you mad. And they mentioned that Killix a Roblox YouTuber that has an audience of 13 years old. And this is bitterly ironic. You say that, but uh, are you sure you're okay showing this to a bunch of fetuses? 
I don't know man, kind of fucked up. They like to repeat themselves a lot. I know I've used this criticism a lot, but write a script. If you're going to do this, respond to someone who said some fuck shit. Write a script. Balls deep, nigga, like. So in the first five seconds, he uses a word that should never, ever, ever be used. Oh man, sorry, I'm black, but uh, no N word for you. You know what? If it makes things fairer, EB family, here you go. N word pass. Go say the N word now. And he already goes into the over sexualization, pedophilia language. Pedophilia language. Oh, he's 17? Pedophile. He's an edgy teen? Pedophile. Max BT Show. Please make a video on Killick. Call him a pedophile. Well, what is his name? Sorry, it's so forgettable. Killick. Killick. Yeah, guys, I uh, can't mention about the situation. I can't even remember his name. This is YouTube drama now, kids. Max Beachy Show, please come back. I need someone else like you on YouTube. God damn. In the moment, I molded a lot during the Max Beachy Show drama, but it was so fun. That is no way to speak to women. Yeah, but uh, if I do it to a man, no one cares. Jesus, I don't know what to say. Anyways, I'm gonna leave my commentary until the end of the video because it has taken me a long time today to calm down. No man, mold. Please mold, it'll make the drama so much better. I just wanna make you mad. I mean, ain't nothing wrong with that. You don't mind, do you? I want to make you mad. Does this sound like the kind of language that somebody would say that has an audience and a platform and has access to young viewers? What point are you even trying to drive home now? Huh? Uh, I don't get it. I just want to make you mad. Bruh, kind of gay. Can't make people mad? And those are cool for his deplatforming, which is uh, pretty funny. Just a reminder, Killick is referring to a 15-year-old minor right now. Just a reminder, Killick is a 17-year-old minor. Oh no, man, seems pretty important to me. And also, uh, thank you, you brought back the case nice that okay sign. Got me licking my lips. Oh, you took a classic from the Zenison channel. Good to see, man. You got the, uh, slow-mo Vegas action, uh, GG, man. Good choice. They try and go after Killick for saying that she doesn't know how to spell. And, uh, yeah, they're just going into straight up autism at this point. Then they make fun of his appearance, which... If you have to go into personal attacks to even get dirt on someone, you've lost respect from me. He literally spent the past 10 minutes gawking at a 15-year-old girl and he can't remember how to spell Gabriella. Uh, first off, it hit 9-11. Funny. And second off, can we just play the clip back where you said that you can't remember his name? Bit hypocritical. They do a shit job of proving Killick's hypocrisies by saying he switched from other games to Roblox and uh... I mean, uh, okay. I can't be arsed anymore. Then they do another shit job at proving that he's a rapist. And if you've gone that deep, uh... You're pretty retarded. Rape? Talking about gang banging? Absolutely. Absolutely. So he is referring to a 15 year old minor, a child, a girl, and talking about getting raped violently. I don't have much experience in the uh, gangbang scene. I'm up more for that one woman shit, but uh, it doesn't have to be rape. To be honest, I think they've convoluted their own argument. It went from uh, just being mean, to being sexist, to being a pedophile, to now a rapist. Oi! Leafy, say the line. Yo, is this person fucking retarded? They then try to accuse Killick of being mentally ill and advocate for deplatforming again, which is, uh... Yeah, just great, man. Also, I wanna know, how much are the editors getting paid for this shit? Because I might sign up. I am an entertainer. I am a content creator. I am an entertainer, and I am a content creator. No, you're not. Let's look up the uh, definition of content creator. Individuals who produce content to upload to the social media platform, YouTube. Uh, I think Killick uploads YouTube videos. Uh, I'm not sure though. Let's look at the 
EEB family as a, they did a lot of research. They go on this rant like they are higher up than others because uh, they make content for fetuses. Something like that. I honestly don't care anymore. We are the kindest, nicest, most loving people. We are the kindest, nicest, most loving people. Thank you for jerking yourselves off a bit more for the rest of the video. Honestly means the world to me. So you need to get off the internet. That's number one. And we have already contacted our partner managers at YouTube to make sure that your channel is taken away. This is how far YouTube has gone down. Just a bunch of corporate bullshit. They're literally saying, yeah, fuck you. You wanted to make a living out of YouTube? You said some edgy shit that was probably satirical? Was you a minor? Fuck you. And what's even worse is that he probably got millions flagging his YouTube channel because, uh, why not? They, they mentioned Facebook. And uh, yeah, that's funny. I honestly don't care about the rest of the video. They say he's sexist, a rapist, a pedophile. And honestly, I have one thing to say to you. Put your head in an oven. Cause I need that. Cause I need that. In conclusion, EB family, you said some really gay shit. You're probably mentally disabled. And uh, yeah, great video. Calling for deplatforming people and not doing proper research before making claims about other people. So, uh, good video either way. EB fans, come at me. GG, well played. I might farm this drama. I say that every time and I never do so well. Uh, here's a promise if this video hits 15 likes, I'll make a second video on the drama. But, uh, other than that, subscribe, like the video, like for your very own fetus audience. Take care. Toxic distress will show you out, and as a great man once said, please have yourselves a damn good one. Then go and go off yourself. There's no saving yourself. Please jump off a bridge. I don't want you to in the same Every day, clean, day and night, see Kidnap your girl, make a movie, call me Spike I keep myself high in the sky like a kite Ladies wanna bite me, uh, I make money nightly Strap like a bite